It's Thursday the 21st of January. Have you ever wondered what happens when you put a box of wine in the microwave? Wonder no more! Because the Europeans, they've done it. And they filmed it. And I'm going to play it to you. <laughs> Jean-Claude, what you up to tonight? I don't know. We have so much wine. I just cannot be bothered to drink anymore. And I hate microwaves. Now, there are some lucky people in the world. I once knew a man who won a speedboat without actually entering a competition. The competition didn't even exist. They just gave him a speedboat. I was there. I saw that. But there is one man who has to be the luckiest man in the world. I know! In three months, this guy from Russia has been dubbed the luckiest man on YouTube. Until now. I got some friends over in Russia. Hooked me up with some more of that CCTV footage. Check this out. Roll the clip, Vladimir. His name's Vladimir because he's a Russian. Ooh! Jeez. Well, that was lucky. Whew. Yeah. No. Oh. Well, at least I didn't get hit by that. Ah. Oh. Jeez. Well, at least I didn't get hit by that. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, at least I didn't get hit by the. Oh, dang it. Oh, 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 oh. Meanwhile, over in California, a man shot his way out of a sinking vehicle. Basically, this guy was coming home from work in his car. His phone rang, it startled him, he swerved off the road, landed in a lake. As the car was sinking, he managed to pull out his gun, shoot the window out so he could jump free and survived which is awesome. What I love about this is the Californian authorities released a statement saying how lucky he was to have the gun with it. And they're right. If he didn't have it, then he wouldn't have been able to shoot his way out. He would have drowned. It would have been awful. I'm just not that sure it's a good idea for him to have a gun. This is the man who swerved into a lake because his phone rang. I don't think we should give him his gun back. I don't think we should give him anything. The next day, he went home and shot his microwave. The doorbell rang and he punched his hamster in the face. His hamster? He didn't do anything wrong. He just wanted some nuts and a little love. And one of those drinks things with the, and lets out a little, a little drip when you, when you lick, the, lick the bottom of it. In other news, the floor collapsed in a town hall in Sweden during a Weight Watchers session. And so far, nobody's sure why. I mean, I could take a guess. The best thing about this is that the Weight Watchers have said they are going to take it upon themselves to try and investigate why this happened. That's like Jude Law investigating why the remake of Alfie was so bad. Or, or cocaine trying to figure out where Amy Winehouse went wrong. Or Russell Crowe investigating why he's such a dick. Yeah, that one's not such a good analogy. He just is. Sir, what do you want, Detective Russell Crowe? I've got the results back from my investigation. Turns out it was me all along, sir. I am just a dick. So that's it. Rate, comment, subscribe as usual, and I'll see you next week. Hi, I'm Tom, and this was a, another video that I made. Yeah, I've, I've got to work on that.